Hello guys, how are you? Hello, welcome to Captain Iceman's uh, review for the flight operational flight plan scene brief from Hurricane. This is an add-on that uh, works based on a Lua script that is amazing and it's awesome. And uh, I'm going to tell you why. Because after you watch the video of how it's installed and how it works, there's a video from Hurricane already there. So I'm just going to skip the portion of installation and uh, how to link it with your scene brief but <coughs> what he was working lately was uh, to add actually something that will keep you busy during your flights and that is the portion of uh, flight log and uh, as you can see what this uh, Lua script is doing is just linking whatever you have on your scene brief recent flight plan and will bring you with this nice window here that you can interact with it and then you can see all the data that has been uh, that we need to put in the FMS and uh, all the pertinent data that's available like really in a simple way to take a look at your flight plan your fuel your block fuel and your flight log but uh, let's let's start from the beginning so let's go into the, let's jump into the cockpit and I'm already here in the 737-300 it's already been energized and the, the IRS has been aligned already so the first thing that you want to do is uh, we're gonna read here the cruise uh, the cruising system like the cost index here in 35 so this is something that you want to put here in your cost index and the FMC, so you will put here 35. Then you want to see like the gross weight and uh, zero fuel weight and your reserves. So I'm gonna go for the block fuel portion, and this is uh, the amount of fuel that we need to load to be to comply with the flight plan. So we're going to put um, the fuel and it's going to be 16,136 pounds so it's going to be 16,000.2 That is our plum fuel Then we're going to put uh, the zero fuel weight and this is something that we can find in this area here, in the weights, zero fuel weight so it is, this will be 1,003,871 uh, we're gonna put 103.9 we just run the numbers and that's our zero fuel weight and then you can see what our gross weight is really and uh, the reserves so if we look at for the reserves we're gonna look at this area here where it says like uh, final reserve it's 2.645 so we're gonna put 2.7 on our cruising altitude it's gonna be we just search for the cruising altitude for this flight plan. It is 330. So we're going to put flight level 330 as our cruising altitude. And as soon as you do this in the FMC from the from the X egg, you'll see with the ISA deviation and the cross wind, uh, the average cross wind is enabled. So we need to grab this data here from the, the right uh, top corner and this is, uh, you can see your average wind here it's 250 from the 255 degrees with an average of 27 knots so we're gonna put that here 255 with 027 so we're gonna just put 255, 027 and then another data that we need to put is the uh, ISA deviation so I'm gonna look for the average ISA and this is 
plus 13, so we're just going to put 13, and this is our ISA deviation. Now you have completed the mode uh, performance in its page, and then just click execute, and then with this data, you can just go, set your takeoff, and your speeds will already be there and you are ready to go. Thank you for watching this video of uh, how to field uh, FMS with uh, operational flight plan from Simbrief. I highly recommend this add-on. And this is just the part one of the video, but we'll be making the part two where you can actually feel the uh, flight uh, log and keep you busy during your flights. Thank you so much for watching and until the next one.